first thing I did for Maggie is I just took a nail pen and I just drew the lines of the hair. With acrylic paint, just filled in mustard. Okay, so now I drew a bow and I'm just going to fill it in with Lou paint. So you just draw the pacifier like that and then we're going to fill it in with red. Then you kind of just fill in lines accent because she's supposed to be cousin it. And Okay, once you actually get the lines um, laid in, you're just going to put a top coat on. I use such a beat and it'll really make it look nice and put it all together. When you use acrylic paint, you have to put a top coat on. Otherwise, um, you wash your hands, it's going to come off because it's water-based. Same with the pens. Now we're going to draw in Marge. So now I'm going to start to fill in Marge's hair. It's way too long for the entire picture, so I didn't really draw it all the way to the top, but it's good enough. The hardest part about doing cartoons is I'm looking at a picture to do this. And the hardest part is the picture is way bigger than what you're about to draw. So it's learning perspective. And sometimes I get it right and sometimes I get it wrong and I have to start all over. It just really depends. So I finished adding in the blue and I started adding in her face and realized I wanted to go a little bit wider. So I just made some adjustments here. So this is what it looks like once I kind of cleaned it up a little bit and uh, widened the face. Now I'm gonna lay in the eyes. 
So I basically am laying in the first pass of the eyes because in the middle we're going to actually lay in the nose and then I'll finish it. But basically um, I just made like half moons with the eyes with the pen. It's so much easier to do with the pen than with the brush and then laid a dot in for the eyes. And then again, I'm going to go in and adjust that middle right now um, and add some lines along here. So now I've laid the eyes in, put a little eyelashes up at the top here and um, filled out the nose. So that's March before we put on the top coat. And when you put on the top coat, it will smooth it out. But um, I have some areas that I'm noticing where um, I need to fill in with blue and do some work on her. So I'm going to come back to her later. So I kind of laid in the beginning of Homer. Obviously things will change, but that's my base. So I added in the base color around the teeth and the mouth. Um, and now I'm going to lay in some more colors and detail. Laid in the eyes and finished putting all the color in. And I'm just going to keep adding more and more details to it. Laid in the mustache. And that's pretty much it for Homer. I'm just going to put a top coat. I might do a little bit more refining later. And here's the base for Bart. That's what we're going to start with and elaborate on. So now we have the mustard color all laid in. And I'm going to put in the eyes. So that's basically Bart. This is the basic outline of Lisa. And I'm just going to fill it in. This is the base of Lisa. I added a little color at the bottom and uh, laid in her nose. A little bit of kind of wrinkles above her eyes. 